Now here are a few short conversations. We looked at that one. The one we looked at may be the best. We examined that one. The one we examined may be the best. We talked about that one. The one we talked about may be the best. We chose that one. The one we chose may be the best. We picked out that one. The one we picked out may be the best. We selected that one. The one we selected may be the best. Now here are a few conversations related to sending and receiving letters. Are you writing a letter? Yes, I'm writing to my family. Do you write letters very often? Yes, I write five or six letters a week. Do you write letters very often? No, I hate to write letters. It takes a lot of time. It sure does. Did Robert get a letter? Yes, he got one yesterday. Does he get many letters? Yes, he gets some every day. Charles wrote me a long letter. When did he write to you? He sent the letter to me about a week ago. He hasn't even sent me a postcard yet. We wrote to Mary's sister last week. Has she written to you yet? No, she hasn't. She wrote to me a few days ago. Now here are a few more conversations about letters. Have you written to your brother yet? Yes, but I haven't mailed the letter yet. I went to the post office half an hour ago. Why didn't you tell me? Did your friend in San Francisco write to you? Yes, I got a letter from her on Thursday. What did she have to say? She said the city was interesting and pretty. Did you write a reply to Peter's letter? Yes, I wrote one on Friday. Did you mention his last letter to you? Yes, I said I had enjoyed his letter a lot. What are you writing? I'm writing a thank you note to the Smiths. What are you doing that for? I had dinner with them, and it's customary to write a thank you note. I wrote a letter to them applying for a job. Was it hard to write your letter of application? Yes, I wanted to sound modest, but also mention my qualifications. It's always hard to write about yourself. Now here are a few conversations related to getting change. Have you got any change? What do you need? I need change for a quarter. Here are two dimes and five pennies. Can you change the five dollar bill? I'm sorry, I don't have change. What should I do? Go to the cashier's desk. Can you change this ten dollar bill? How do you want it? A five and five ones, please. Here you are. Do you have change for a dollar bill? Just a minute, and I'll see. I need some quarters. Yes, I can change it and give you two quarters. This is a change machine. Do you really get money from it? Sure. Just put a fifty cent piece in that slot. It works. I've got a quarter, two dimes, and a nickel. Now here are a few short conversations. I need change for a nickel. Here are five pennies. I need change for a dime. Here are ten pennies. I need change for a quarter. Here are twenty-five pennies. I need change for a half dollar. Here are fifty pennies. I need change for a dollar. Here are one hundred pennies. Now here are a few conversations where we will learn about American money and prices. I understand the American money system well. 
then how many cents are there in a nickel? There are five. That's exactly right. There are five. Now here we can also use a different amount. I understand the American money system well. Then how many cents are there in a dime? There are ten, aren't there? That's exactly right. There are ten. Now we can also change to another amount. I understand the American money system well. Then how many nickels are there in a dime? There are two, aren't there? That's exactly right. There are two. Now we can again change to a different amount. I understand the American money system well. Then how many cents are there in a quarter? There are 25, aren't there? That's exactly right. There are 25. Now a different amount. I understand the American money system well. Then how many nickels are there in a quarter? There are five, aren't there? That's exactly right. There are five. Now again, we can change a different amount. I understand the American money system well. Then how many quarters are there in a half dollar? There are two, aren't there? That's exactly right. There are two. Now another amount. I understand the American money system well. Then how many dimes are there in a half dollar? There are five, aren't there? That's exactly right. There are five. Now another amount. I understand the American money system well. Then how many quarters are there in a dollar? There are four, aren't there? That's exactly right. There are four. Now another amount. I understand the American money system well. Then how many nickels are there in a dollar? There are 20, aren't there? That's exactly right. There are 20. Now here is a similar example. What do you need today? I'd like a pound of butter. Butter is 65 cents a pound. That'll be all right, thanks. Now here we can use different things. What do you need today? I'd like a quarter of milk. Today, milk is 38 cents a quarter. That'll be all right, thanks. What do you need today? I'd like a loaf of bread. Today, bread is 20 cents a loaf. That'll be all right, thanks. What do you need today? I'd like a jar of jelly. Today, jelly is 36 cents a jar. That'll be all right, thanks. What do you need today? I'd like a can of tuna fish. Today, tuna is 85 cents a can. That'll be all right. Thanks. What do you need today? I'd like a box of cookies. Today, cookies are 42 cents a box. That'll be all right. Thanks. What do you need today? I'd like a pint of cream. Today, cream is 41 cents a pint. That'll be all right. Thanks. What do you need today? I'd like a dozen eggs. Today, eggs are 87 cents a dozen. That'll be all right. Thanks. Now, here are a few conversations related to what's it like outside. Is it raining now? Yes, it is. It's raining very hard. Does it rain very much in this area? Yes, it rains a lot in the spring and fall. How's the weather? It's raining outside now. Is it raining very hard? No, it isn't. It's just sprinkling. What's the weather like outside? I think 
it's going to rain. It was nice a few hours ago. It was beautiful, wasn't it? How's the weather today? It's quite cold and damp. How are the winters here in general? They are usually rather mild. Is it raining outside now? Yes, it is. And it's quite cold. I think I'll stay home today. I certainly wish I could too.